this video I'm making four tensioner blocks which are used on the end of the tracking to tension the, the track by pulling the rear idler back and forth. Also over on the left hand side at the same piece I'm putting the circle piece which is seen below the end pieces of the neck rod. The front neck rod has that piece. So I'm also machining that out in the same material. So I will uh, record this a little bit later in the process and show you how it's gone along. Thanks for watching the video. Just an update video just to show a bit more progress. As you can see we've moved along a bit more. Uh, the blocks are starting to get down there and also that front piece is starting to get down there in depth. So we will uh, come back to this video again a little bit later if the parts are more close to the institution. As you can see in this video, the parts are pretty well done now. We've got the four tensioner blocks and also the round piece that goes at the bottom of the block on the front neck rod. The only problem is I have to do with a longer milling tool really. You're really pushing the lot to be honest. Um, the tool's going pretty deep. Um, right, and thanks for watching this video. As you can see, things are really starting to come along now. There's uh, not that much left to do yet. Now, just um, 120,000 left. cutter will clear, but uh, I'm going to have to get some longer cutters in the next time. It's uh, getting there.